Chefs, and welcome to Up With The Curtain, where the curtain goes sideways. I've got a special guest here at Sardi's on 44th Street, New York City, Kate Reinders. Welcome. Hi. Thanks Hi, for thanks. joining my show. So you are in Meteor Shower, and you are one of the standbys for two very funny and famous ladies, Laura Benanti and Amy, Amy Schumer. Schumer. What is that like? It is awesome. It is the best job and kind of the worst job. In what way? In that it's like a daily, um, have you ever heard of the actor's nightmare? You know, where uh, they're like, get on stage right now, you're going <laughs> on. And you're like, what, now, huh? Yeah, so that could happen at any moment, but it has not. So explain what exactly your role means as the standby. It means I am there for emergencies only in case either one of them you know, something happens, like they get food poisoning or they don't feel like doing the show. But luckily, Amy is a super trooper, and even though she's had a little of the pooper, uh -oh. she has still gone on, because she's hardcore, and um, they both do feel like it. Wow. So, so have you, you've had a lot of rehearsals for this role? Uh, yeah, no. Nope. No. Not at all. Wow. Uh, so how do you had do it? three Within rehearsals. Three rehearsals. Uh, we rehearsed one part a couple weeks ago, then the next part last week, and then today we just did both parts. So what was it like backstage during previews and now that it's been open? Um, it was like, please don't be out. And they weren't. And um, I think I should say that my standby partner in crime is Graham Rowett. Yes. So I met him. He's great. He's the best. Yes. So, um, yeah, he covers both guys. I cover both girls. And so in the beginning, we would just be in our dressing room that we share, watching the monitor and just sort of like saying all the lines all the time. Like to each other, practicing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then we realized that it wasn't that helpful to be both parts all the time. So now we've tried to just sort of be one part at a time. So it's not like you're sitting backstage twiddling your thumbs. You're you're working backstage at every show. Well, yeah, because we're afraid. Right. Yeah. And because it's, I feel like it's the sort of thing, like, if I'm totally prepared, then I won't have to go on. But if I'm not, then the phone could ring at any second. What is the backstage environment like with so many funny people involved in this show? Uh, it's what you think it would be. It's pretty awesome. Um, everybody is so talented and hilarious, and um, I mean, we're sort of up in our tower, we call it, but we can hear like the funny shenanigans going on all the time. Amy and Laura have a little like, you know, fun yin yang. Uh -huh. um, I don't want to like tell their tales, but um, a fun like game of of. So <laughs> banter going so, on. So there's only six people in the show, including you, well, well, six, including you. As yeah, there's four people in the right, show. Right, right, right. I'm, I'm adding you, but I'm adding you. That so, was very nice of you. Thank so you very much. There's six cast members that have to be there. So do you each have your own dressing room, or uh, do you share? No, they have their own dressing rooms because they are stars, and Graham and I share because we are attached to the hip. And are you dressed in costume backstage? No. No. Okay. No, 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 no. How did you how did you find out you got this part? Well, I auditioned and then I thought there's no way I'll ever get that because that would be too awesome. And then uh, my phone rang like an hour later and they were like, Yeah, Jerry Zach's thinks you're funny. Great. Thanks, Jerry Zach. Yeah. And you and C Martin's been in the rehearsals with you, you were telling me earlier. Oh yeah, he's been there. Um he is awesome. I mean, not like I'm hanging out with him, like we're friends hanging out, but um, you know, I try to just like, from the sidelines, just observe the genius at work at all times. Yeah. Um, but he's, he's kind of quiet, like a quiet genius person. Um, so I want to ask you something about another, one of the shows that you were in. Speaking of which, you have been Laura Benanti's understudy once yes. before. In yes, yes. Which is really funny, nice. so you know exactly how she works. But I want to talk about Gypsy, which is literally right across the street where it was at the Schubert Theater. Mm -hmm. There was a photo I saw on Instagram, and it was like a big cast reunion. Like a year or two ago or something oh, like that. Or, were you there? No, maybe. Oh, no. no. It was when I was living in LA. Oh, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 Okay, so I should have looked at the photo before no, I No, but it, everybody's but, still around. Yeah. I mean, Michael McCormick is there doing Hello, Dolly right now. Um, and Bernadette's going in right, in a second. Right, of course. Right. We, we know. We all, yeah. We're all aware of that. Okay. And she's going to be awesome. Amazing. All right, so it's time for the 11 o'clock hour where oh. we're going to play the Broadway Rorschach game. Oh, So here's boy. how it works. You guys all know. So I'm going to hold up a know. playbill, okay. and you just say something funny, uh, the first thing that comes to your mind when you see the playbill. Okay. So I've got new new stuff. 
All right, and the first one is Rhett. A show that I wish I could be in but never will because I don't belt. All right, next one. Xanadu. Oh, a show that I could be in because I like to roller skate. Oh my gosh, her skill set's right there. And this one is back oh, on Broadway. Oh, and we love her. Carrie we love Butler, her. back She's on awesome. Broadway yes. in a few more months. All right, thou shalt not. That looks like a show that I would absolutely like to be in. You Actually, could, you I feel like my husband and I, we could be in this. Because this looks like the kind of parts that he's really good at. Kate Levering was in this show. Oh, yeah, she's cool. You could do that. Yeah, her name's Kate. Yes, there we go. Uh, my name's that was that show. All right, and the last one, I can't remember what it is. Oh, The Addams Family. I actually never saw it. Sorry. All right. Kate Rinders, thanks so much for being on my show. See you next time. Thanks for having me. Bye.